Doha, many people and businesses too are looking for ways to save on gas. We found one police department experimenting with a new device. News 4 Sharon Johnson with how it's working. Sharon. We well, profiled this water for gas system last week, but one police department in the upstate has been looking at this for months. Now they're using it. It looks like a regular SUV, but it's not. Misleading because it's an undercover Honey and Pat police vehicle. And also because it's running on something experimental. People laugh at you for trying some things, but if you don't try, you don't know. Honey and Pat Police Department has just six cars and a few officers and doesn't have a big budget for a large gas bill. So they're using water for gas. Yeah, we've had a few snickers uh, from uh, some people in town that just don't believe it. And naturally, I was skeptical of it when the mayor would talk about it. He's talking about the water for gas system. You build it and attach it to the engine. It then produces hydrogen and oxygen, or what the water for gas people call HHO. It's supposed to give you better gas mileage. You know, the numbers speak for themselves. Six to eight miles per gallon is is a pretty good number, pretty good increase. So. They discussed it for six months before trying it out, now planning to put the HHO system on all Honey of Half Town cars. I had done research on it, and uh, with the situation like it is, and you and I fuel costs is so going up so high that I felt like I had to do something to try to save the taxpayers' money here in our town. The mayor's even putting it on his personal car. The town of Honey and Pap is also considering using vegetable oil, used vegetable oil, converted to diesel fuel for their larger vehicles. The mayor says that they're looking for all kinds of ways to save taxpayers some money.